It's a restaurant for the people, built by a celebrity chef that grew up literally half a mile down the road on Peachtree. <laughs> chef Linton Hopkins and Greg Best have built one of the most talked about restaurants in the history of Atlanta, Georgia. And oh yeah, their burger has been voted best on planet Earth by just about everybody. I'm getting mine. Let's hang at Holman and Finch. This road, Peachtree, right in front of us, was a dirt road when my grandfather was a boy. I grew up half a mile from here. I live half a mile from here. My father grew up half a mile from here. My kids went to the same school he went to. Uh, the stories in our family are about riding the trolley up and down Peachtree right in front of us. It's about being part of a community. And there's no better thing than with food and drink and hospitality to be part of a community. And that just led to Holman and Finch. The burger is legitimately legendary. The best ever. It's this juicy business, so mm. The burger is taken off in a crazy way, which we never foresaw. There's 24 burgers. <laughs> That's it. And it's hard to get the 24. There are people who come here at 7.30, sit down and wait and place their burger order and stay hogging the table till 10 o'clock because they're waiting for that bullhorn to come out. Burger yeah, and if you sit on the edge over here, which is a lovely little spot, you can literally watch them assembly line through the window, the whole business, and it's fun. It's like watching a uh, Picasso. <laughs> well, it's like all this salivating. All of a sudden, you start right. to smell meat. And then they open the gate, and they come out. And they flood. Right. Now let's head to the kitchen with Chef Linton Hopkins to see firsthand what all the fuss is about. And we're back here. I kind of feel like uh, getting to go in the batting cage with Chipper Jones. This is like, you know, this is what it's all about. Linton Hopkins, the ingredients for the burger are in front of us. they are angels singing. I mean, this is the place to be. You see, look, it's not many ingredients. No, it's not It's not simple. about things I add onto the burger. It's great American beef, fresh bread from our bakery. You got shaved onions. Where'd you get that? Anywhere fancy? So this is Kraft American cheese. Kraft American, I've and heard of it. And if you look at it, what's so great about Kraft? He invented American cheese. Literally. Absolutely, yeah. So, so, so it's not just he made a good form of it. Mr. Kraft actually. It's his deal. Just look at that. Yeah, no, it's hard for me to look at and stand next to you. Not that you're not a handsome man. I mean, you don't get any. Good. <laughs> no, I'm just these Seriously? are sold. That's the only reason I have the show. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I got here like 9.15, 9.30, after a movie. I couldn't get a burger, right? Well, you know, I didn't queue only, up in time. Well, there's only 24. Right, and so what's the key to getting a burger, off-season especially? I can't go to Turner Field, but right. right. Uh, well, on Sundays, we're open all day. Right. And so it's unlimited burgers. So burgers all day on Sunday. Yeah, all day Sunday on Sunday. Sunday is fun day. Sunday, fun day. It's really get here early, you know, if it's, right. be, if it's beginning of the week. You know, get here at 8 o'clock, right. let us know. And so those 24 can be sold out at yeah. 9 o'clock. Are you going to let me work this? Well, hold on, let me get some fries. All right, hold on. Got to have a little bit of the fries. And, and French fries, what's uh, anything special you're doing with we, them? We than... double fry them so that you cook the insides on the first lower cook, and then you go crispy fry. All right, so let's yeah. get the visual. Oh, that's the beauty. I mean, look at it, though. That's what it's, it's about. It's good. Right it's fluffy on the outside. The bun. As good a crispy. burger as there is on the planet. As moist as it gets. Perfect flavors. Can we toast the fry together? Absolutely. Here's to you. To and you, your man. success. Thanks for having us. The burger definitely lives up to its reputation. And when we come back, it's rock, paper, scissors. You'll never guess what's at stake. Talk to me about the food at all. The small plates especially, as you're sitting there getting to talk, you can just continuously order one thing after another. What's going on here, bro? Double eggs. eggs. Standing here, I keep looking at that double egg, right? Yep. All right, rock, paper, scissors. No, I'm not going to take it unless I win, right? One, two, three, shoot. Wait, rock, wait. paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, I think the paper it crushes you. Seriously? I'm a good winner. Dude, you're the man. Thank you. What do you like about eating in a bar? Atmosphere. Oh, yeah. Yeah, tell me about that. More relaxed. The bartenders know what they're doing. They like to eat all mixed with the food, the drinks. Their, their bartenders are like yeah. scientists oh, up back yeah. there. Oh, yeah. 
bartender. What makes a great bartender? Why are those guys so good? They know what goes together. They know how to make it. They know how to entertain. Now let's hear from the acclaimed chef about what makes the food at Holman and Finch so outstanding. This is just a glorious looking uh, plate, uh, a glorious looking table of food. Sure. Well, it's yeah. fun. I mean, you see the charcuterie plate of Georgia, you got our cheeseburger, of course. Some of what you talk about, even folks watching on TV, it may get it, it, intimidating. You guys try to understand, too, it's still about great tasting food and Yeah, and we want no pretentiousness. And it's weird that we live in a culture now where from scratch is somehow highfalutin. Right. We just cook from scratch. I didn't grow up in restaurants. My mom cooked from scratch. My grandfather made vinaigrette every night, just a little peanut oil and mustard. And, I mean, that's how we eat. When we talk to our guests about it, you know, we're just unassuming and like, hey, eat this because it's good. Right. You know, it tastes really good. Right. And I'm going to do something for you guys. You're on the show. Once this airs, you have a chance. You guys may make it in Thank the restaurant. Oh, yes. Yeah. Thank you. Though nobody knew those guys Look, until they were on Five LA's. years, you've been freaking <laughs> I know, you've been waiting. I've been, I've been calling. Been you never returned my calls. Listen, I've been very busy. <laughs> Cheers. I think you guys Cheers. have a shot.